Welcome to Sage Pastel Payroll's How to Process Mukba Leaf Pay video. These fields need to be set up to ensure that the calculation calculates correctly. Navigate to Setup, Company Parameters and ensure that the council has been selected. Navigate to Setup, Transactions. On transaction 0001, please ensure that Do Not Use BCA checkbox has been checked. Navigate to Payslips and ensure that either the code 5008 or 5009 have been processed and have the correct values. You can view our correction video in the description box below if you need to make adjustments. How to process leave pay when leave is processed in Pastel Payroll. Take note of the below. Only hourly paid employees will calculate the code M777. On the employee's pay slip, navigate to the leave tab. In the first available line, enter the code 0001. Enter the date from and the day to. The days taken will calculate automatically and remarks can be entered but are not mandatory. Save the payslip and navigate to the Income tab. You will now see two new transactions, Transaction 5013 and Transaction M777. Transaction 5013 will pay the daily rate for each public holiday that was included in the leave period. This will be the calculation for transaction code M777. Remember to adjust the hourly pay in recurring transactions if applicable. How to process leave if you don't process leave in payroll. Navigate to the Income tab. Enter the code M777 in the first available white line. It is important to note that the quantity that needs to be entered should be the amount of weeks and not in days. This employee is going on leave from the 16th of December 2020 until the 8th of January 2021. The 16th, 25th, 26th and the 1st are public holidays and all except for the 26th falls on a working day. You will now count the working days that the employee will be on leave for. In this case, it should be 15 working days. Once you have the working days, you will need to divide it with the average days per week. This will give you the amount of weeks that this employee will be on leave for. Please note that you can only round up to the second decimal. You can process the code 5013. You will have to click on override and manually calculate the period amount value by taking the daily rate that this employee earns and multiplying it by the amount of public holidays that falls within the leave period. View the formula that M007 uses to calculate its value. Remember to adjust your hourly pay in recurring transactions if applicable. As you have not processed the leave in Pastel Payroll, you will have to manually zero out the following four weeks that the employee will be on leave. Thank you for watching our video. Reach out to us on our SoundCloud platforms.